Good morning, Beach Bums. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Matthew Isbell. This is my channel, Bama Beach Bum. Consider subscribing. Post a lot of fishing videos, primarily on the beach, but mostly saltwater fishing videos. Something I have not done enough of this year is walk the beach, throw in a popper. It's not like my favorite thing to do. And for some reason this year, I just have not spent a ton of time doing it. It looks a little rougher and choppier this morning than uh, just what I can see than what the forecast called for. But we did just have a little cell of a storm pass by. So I'm sure that has a lot to do with chopping things up. But just gonna be doing a little bit of walking. Got one rod, got the bummy stick with me. 50 pound mono leader. Down to my 135 rooster popper. Gonna drop the flops. Hopefully, no one steals them. I've had two pair of flip-flops stolen doing that, so it's kind of risky. But yeah, it is de definitely a lot uh, rougher than I thought. But that is probably the reason why that just passed through right there. But we'll get to fish and see if, uh, see if we can do the popper. If not, may have to switch over to a spoon or something subsurface if we're having a difficult time. Fortunately, with, the, with a popper, even with some chop and roughness, you can usually still work it, still get the action. But it's a beautiful morning. You can see behind me, the sun is trying to peek out between the clouds. I've got the head mount GoPro on today. Just trying that out since I am throwing the popper. So hopefully you can see some of the action. I'm not a very tall individual. I'm, I'm only 5'8", so it doesn't really help you see over things too well. Oh, first cast! That was my first cast. They were already hooked up on something. What? First cast of the morning. Oh, it's heavy. I wonder if it's foul hooked. Yeah, this has got to be foul hooked. It feels really weird. Good gracious. Back down the drag just a little bit. It's a little bluefish. He's a little guy, but he felt heavy. First fish of the morning is a fat bluefish. Oh, there's baits getting popped right there. Get him, oh, look at that. Goodness. Okay, we got some activity going on this morning. Look at all these baits that just got pushed up on the beach. I'm not even sure what those are, I need to investigate here see what what kind of baits these little these fish up closer are eating let's see what do we got oh. and these are tiny little elwa there's a fish dang oh did he come off dang he hit it aggressively Woo! there's some lightning out there i don't know if that was a ladyfish or a blue Probably a bluefish. There's a fish. There we go. There's a good one. Yes. Oh, yeah. Real good fish. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Man, he feels good. Heavy ton of seaweed <clears throat> there we go man this feels like a solid fish oh nice blue not look at that hooked well holy smokes that is a fat bluefish they are gorging themselves out here Fred, I don't think you can handle this guy. Fat, stinking blue. Oh, he just choked up a whole, a half of a ladyfish. This bluefish had half of a ladyfish in his mouth. Nice bluefish this morning. We got another storm rolling in, so I can't move around too much. I gotta work my way kind of back. Wow, there is so much dead bait on the beach. We're gonna get you back, but that's insane. Look at that. That's half of a ladyfish that was inside this 
bluefish's mouth. We'll get you back. See ya. Good gracious. I don't know if this counts as an additional catch here. Today's video is sponsored by Waterland Sunglasses. Make sure you check those guys out. They've been an incredible sponsor for the channel for a couple of years now. And so they support creators like myself. They allow us to bring you content absolutely free. And they also have amazing products. That's the sunglasses I wear every day. I'm out on the water. My wife, same thing. She's got several pair of Waterland sunglasses because they recently, this year, just came out with ladies sunglasses. Also, the glass lenses. So they've really upped their game this year as far as options that you have for yourself and your family. They do have some sweet apparel options as well. It's about to be cold. We're getting into fall and winter. So you're going to be needing some hoodies and maybe some cotton long sleeve shirts. They've got you covered. So make sure you check it out. Anything that you purchase on their website when you go to checkout, if you use promo code BEACHBUM, it's going to get you 15% off. So make sure you utilize that. Take advantage of it. Get geared up for the winter season. Make sure you've got your optics ready to go in case you're doing any sight fishing, which we should have some opportunities, especially with salt water. Should have some redfish coming in on the flats, coming in the creeks, rivers, bays, all of that good stuff. So make sure you're geared up and ready to go. But let's get back to fishing. Oh, oh, there we go, there we go. Yes, yes, nice lick, man, it's so fun, throwing a popper for these fish, Woo! they got more tug than you would think, I don't think this one's as big as the last one. Oh yeah, still a good fish, popper blue, another little blue fish, little guy, he's not nearly as big as the last one, but uh, we'll get him back, see if we can get another. See you, buddy. These blue fish are fired up on this Halco this morning. You don't ever know when they're gonna be eating poppers or you have to go to a spoon or what sometimes it gets weird on as far as what they'll eat but when they're hitting a popper that's always the most fun i'm having a little difficulty working it it's a little awkward because i'm getting seaweed all over my lawn and with the waves but it doesn't seem to matter too much we're still getting the eats that was a good cast that's the one i wanted right there Oh my goodness, that might not have been a bluefish. That was big. I don't know if that was a jack or a shark. That might have been a shark. That was a huge blow up. Got my, my best cast of the day and had a giant explosion. It didn't touch the lure, but it, it sure enough wanted it. All right, we got to do our weather check. Oh yeah, that's, that's a pretty, pretty decent blob there. Still a little ways off, but it's definitely headed this direction. Oh gosh! Oh, he came out of the freaking water for it. Oh my goodness. Come here. Come here. Woo! Man, that was a lick. Good gracious. I saw the whole fish. <laughs> Come out of the water for this thing. Another solid blue on the popper this morning. These fish are crazy. We're going to get you back. So awesome. Coming out of the water for it like that. See you, buddy. Such a fun way to fish. Walking the beach, throwing a popper. You can get into so many different species. But right now, we've got a ton of bluefish around and some of them have been pretty big this is the first day i've thrown this particular popper so i'm getting getting it nice and scarred up and getting it broken in properly here again like i said this is the halco 135 
Our leader's still good, running 50. We got a loop knot with a swivel. That was awesome. I'm having a great morning. <laughs> Let's get back to fishing. It sure is getting dark over here. <laughs> I have not walked very far away. That I was planning to this morning. I was gonna cover some beach, but that gigantic storm and there's lightning in it has deterred that idea. All right, this is gonna be my last cast. This storm is about on me. That lightning is getting a little too close for comfort. Stinks to have to cut the morning. Ooh, okay, there it is, we're, we're out of here. Just getting onto the beach this morning. Sun is not up yet, but you can see it's gonna be just a beautiful sunrise. We do have a large storm system, but fortunately for us today, everything is moving away from us but have the Halco Rooster Popper 135. I'm gonna start throwing it this morning. Oh! We're hooked up. Fish on. That was my second cast. It does not feel big whatever I've hooked into, and it's little. Tiny blue, I mean, the tiniest bluefish. Check out that tiny blue. He's not much bigger than the lure. All right, he, he caught all three trebles. He's a little guy. We don't have any size regulations on bluefish. We're gonna hang on to him and put him in my freezer for some shark bait in the future. Fred, you're looking mighty glorious this morning with that sun coming up behind you. Oh, there we go. Got another fish. Oh yeah, better fish. Oh, something just... What just... Shark just got him. I had a little fish on. Shark ate him. Oh my gosh. Shark ate him. Oh, he's off. Dang. What the heck? <laughs> I had a little fish on the popper. Shark totally ate him. Held on to him for a second. That was pretty sick. Let's see what's going on with our leader. Oh yeah. Look at that. Wow. Had a little blue fish on. And old Mr. Shark got him. That's pretty crazy. <laughs> Oh, right there, holy smokes. Big blow up, right there. Oh, wow. That was a nice blow up. Let me back down the drag. I, I think this is gonna be a bluefish, but just in case we got a trout or something. Wanna keep a pin. Dang. That was a nice explosion on the uh, popper there. Man, this fish feels heavy. Come on. He's a little bit foul hooked. Yeah. Much better blue here, but still, uh, whew. We've got some big ones around. He's actually hooked pretty well. Just that second treble. Got a piece of them there. Second bluefish of the morning. Nice guy. Not this is a good like average Alabama bluefish. See you, buddy. Thank you. Oh dang! Another one that just came out of the water for it. Right there. Heck yes. Woo! Getting acrobatic. 
Oh man, look at all the seaweed that just got in my line right there. That's crazy. Here, see if we can pop that off. These fish on poppers, man, they're just so cool. He might have got hooked to the top of the head. Yeah. Another blue. He's uh, he's smaller than the last one, but man, they uh, they get fired up on that popper. All right, see you, buddy. Yeah, how's it going? What's your name? I'm Johnny. Johnny. I'm from uh, Lafayette, Louisiana. Oh, okay. Right yeah, on, man. And, uh, we, oh, okay. But I watch you all the time. And... Thank you for watching today's video. Hope you enjoyed it. It was fun getting out there, just throwing the popper around, <laughs> dodging a few storms. This was filmed a little while ago when we were dealing with a lot of storms basically every day, but that's kind of moved on. It's actually been extremely dry weather here recently. We haven't had a ton of rain at all. But if you did enjoy today's video, one of my daughter's favorite shows is Bluey. And I can't help but think about that show because of all the dang bluefish that I caught in this video. And also my wife might be a little upset when she sees this one because I didn't bring any of them home. I will have to do that here soon because she does enjoy eating bluefish, as do I. They are pretty good, despite popular opinion that they are no good to eat. They are pretty good. But comment, Bluey, if you did enjoy the video. Thanks so much for watching, and as always, you stay bummy.